Hey guys, I'm David Pippin. And I'm Heather Dean. And today we're going to talk about questions to ask if you're going to be hiring a real estate agent. So if you're starting to look for homes in the market, of course you're going to be interviewing some real estate agents. You know, there are a few questions you want to ask as you do these interviews. One, are they familiar with the area? Do they know the school districts? Here's a few questions that we think are important when you're interviewing a real estate agent. Are you a full-time agent? People do real estate part-time, and that's fine. Um, but what you really need is access to them pretty much any time. So hopefully they would be a, real, a full-time real estate agent. If they're part-time, my first question would be, do you have a mentor? Do you have someone that's available in case you aren't available to show me properties? How long have you been an agent? With experience comes knowledge, so I think it's really important to find someone with a couple years under their belt. Yeah, but you know, they could also have that mentor or that team leader that works with them. So No, David. <laughs> <laughs> find someone with experience under their belt. But if they are part or if they are a newer agent, you know, ask them if they have a mentor or if they have someone that can really guide you through the processes. Because that brings us to the next point. Are you working with a team? Oh, that is true. Yeah. Yeah. So when you're working with a team, it's easier to have someone to help you show property if you're not available or help guide you through making an offer on a cash property yeah. or FHA, something like that. Another thing to ask is if they work with buyers and sellers. This is more rare now, but earlier, there were people that just worked with buyers all the mm -hmm. time or sellers. Yeah. So you wanna ask them kind of their experience on both sides because uh, at some point, if you do like them, they're probably gonna be selling your house later on. So you need to know kind of what their experience is on both sides. I think it's really important um, working with buyers and sellers, you can kind of get a peek behind the other curtain. Yeah, so that's true. yeah, knowing knowing what a seller is looking for when you're representing a buyer, that's really important, I think. So having someone who's who's seen both sides, I think is crucial. Yeah. And the big question, how do you get paid? How do you get paid? So as a buyer's agent, when I'm working with a uh, person, the listing agent or the listing broker mm -hmm. actually pays our broker, and then they share a percentage of that commission to the buyer's agent. So it actually doesn't cost, as a home buyer, anything. And we get paid once we find you the perfect home. If you're interested in starting the home buying process, check out the link in our description.